Hello friends, today we discuss about the effect of the gyroscopic couple on an aeroplane. In GTU exams, there is one example from gyroscopic couple related to ship or an aeroplane. Today we discuss about aeroplane examples. In aeroplane example, calculations are very simple. We use only 3 to 4 equations but students have some problem in last step related to effect of reactive gyroscopic couple. Today I tell you easiest way to find which part raise or which part dip due to gyroscopic couple without any rule. So, so this, uh, so uh, in figure, uh, this is a top view of an aeroplane. This part is known as a uh, nose and this part, uh, this part is known as a tail end. In example, three conditions are in examples. Three conditions are given. The first condition is propeller rotates in the clockwise direction. View from the tail end. An aeroplane takes a turn to the left. So three conditions are given related to propeller viewing side and aeroplane turn. Aeroplane turn either right or left end. So first we draw. So first we draw one uh, rectangular box. Uh, uh, say aeroplane and one propeller uh, so we use first condition this first condition is given as propeller rotates in the clockwise direction when so we uh, this is a propeller so propeller rotates in clockwise direction so make one arrow clockwise direction second condition is viewing from the tail end so this is your front end and this is your tail end so move the notebook from tail end so this is the direction of viewing so this direction of viewing is tail end okay then aeroplane takes a turn to the left so this is my right hand and this is my left hand so make one arrow to the left hand because aeroplane takes a turn to the left then again then see the arrow uh, both arrows are in opposite direction here both arrows are in opposite direction so there is always the answer is raise the nose if the arrows are in opposite direction the answer is raise the nose so our final answer is then the effect of reactive gyroscopic couple will be raise the nose and dip the tail okay then the effect of reactive gyroscopic couple will be raise the nose and dip the tail i repeat the same procedure here propeller rotates in clockwise direction so i make one arrow in clockwise direction second condition is view from the tail end so i move the notebook from tail side this is the direction of our viewing then aeroplane takes a takes when aeroplane takes a turn to the left so this is my right hand and this is my left hand so i make arrow to the left side and then view direction of both arrows if both arrows are di uh, both uh, both direction uh, both arrows direction are opposite direction then always answer is raise the nose and dip the tail okay uh, for more clarification uh, we take second example in this example uh, again three conditions are given propeller rotates in clockwise direction view from the front end and aeroplane takes left turn so again make one rectangle and propeller okay first condition is propeller rotates in clockwise direction so make clockwise direction so propeller rotates in clockwise direction view from the front side so this is our front end so move the notebook to the front side and aeroplane takes a left turn so this is my right hand and this is my left hand so make arrow to the left side so make arrow to the left side so in this case you see that uh, the direction of both arrows are same so in this case the answer is then the effect of reactive gyroscopic couple will be dip the nose will be dip the nose and raise the tail so you remember only one sentence if both are, uh, both directions are opposite then raise the nose if both directions are same then dip dip the nose thank you